Welcome to YouTubers Love Excel number 57. Hey, as always, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on my YouTube channel, then click on my college website link, and you can download the workbook, YouTubers Love Excel 53 to 57. Hey, in this trick 57, this is a, a video response to Excel Finance trick number 11, how long to pay off your credit card balance. This YouTuber asked, hey, I have this great little template and I actually want to change the balance. So for example, if I change the input here, we have $41 monthly payment, 12 payments a year, 18% annual rate, and a balance on our credit card of this. And we use the NPER function, I'll hit F2 here, to calculate how long to pay it off. And this YouTuber said, hey, I want to change this to 2,500. Enter. Oh, great. Uh, 165 period, so 13 years. But now, what if I change this to 3,000? Oops, number error. Number errors usually mean numbers too small or numbers too big, and infinity is too big. Let's just take a look down here and see what happens. I built a little amortization table. Here's our balance. We send in $41. Oops, there's the problem. Anytime your interest is bigger than your actual monthly payment or period payment, your loan will grow forever. And the number of periods to pay this off is infinite. So the trick is, and remember, this $41 and this original $2,000, this was printed on your credit card balance. So if your balance really was $3,000, it would have some number like, uh, you know, $78. It would tell you. So the trick is, and there's a little note up here, 41, never going to work. And the rule is your actual payment has to be bigger than your interest or your balance on your loan will grow forever and you will be forever indebted. All right, we'll see you next YouTuber trick.